Miss Puerto Rico. From the shiny star of the Caribbean, I am Diana Torres representing Coata, Puerto Rico. There are five to go, Miss Puerto Rico, Diana Torres. Proud favorite in the preliminary competition, and that should give her confidence tonight. Miss Puerto Rico. I've been riding horses for nine years now, and we have a couple of our own, called Fago and Pluto. With animals, I've learned you get a lot farther with kindness than with force, sort of like with people. Our next contestant is Miss Puerto Rico, Diana Torres. She's 18 years of age, university student, studying to become a dentist. Why did you uh, elect dentistry? Well, uh, when I was a little girl, I always liked to be a dentist. And I have braces. And I think that is the, the most important thing. Um, because I know that some people think that it's aesthetic. But I think it's not aesthetic because um, have another problems like um, pains and everything. Mm -hmm. And I, I want to show to the people that uh, good health or a health is a very important thing. Thank you very much. Your family must be very proud of you. Are, is your su familia here? Are they here? Yes. How many people are there? Uh, like 30 people. 30 people are here? Brothers, my, everybody else? My brothers, my father, my, the mayor of my town, and all the people that love me. <laughs> Did your brothers take good care of you when you were a little girl? My brothers? Yes. Yes, they are very jealous. Do you have a boyfriend? <laughs> no, no, I don't have. They have to get through your brothers, in other words. <laughs> yes, to get... before for my brothers and then... <laughs> we thank you so very much for being with us. Thank you, senor. You step over here for the judges. That's Miss Puerto Rico. Next, Miss Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Miss Puerto Rico. Could you select a question, please? All right, this comes from uh, judge number two, A.J. Kitt. May we have your question, please? What do you think is the best thing about living in your country? ¿Qué considera usted que es lo mejor que tiene su país para cuando se vive en él? Bueno, eh, yo considero que mi país tiene muchas de las cosas que, que principalmente nosotros eh, podemos brindarle al mundo. Eh, por ejemplo, puedo decir que tenemos playas como en Hawái, si queremos ver castillos como en España, eh, junglas como en África, eh, castillos y, y, y puentes como en London. Y creo que, que es una gran experiencia y es un gran país para mí. Y estoy muy orgullosa de representarlo. ¿Vas a traducir? Gracias. <laughs> I, uh, I'm very proud of my country. My country has a great deal of uh, things to offer. We have uh, beautiful beaches. We have uh, castles just like the ones you have in Spain. We have jungles like you have in Africa. We have beautiful bridges as you do in London. And uh, we do have a lot of beautiful things there. E? Oh, 20 seconds, unfortunately. And? No, no, I didn't tell her she only has 20 okay, seconds. Okay. 20 seconds solamente. Thank you, you have a very good memory. Please wait here a moment. Diane Harris' family, her national director, the town mayor, and a former Miss Universe from Puerto Rico are all here tonight cheering her on. Well, they won't have much longer to wait now. Muchas gracias. Miss India, please. Miss Puerto Rico, Diana <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, one of these three will be the new Miss Universe.
And finally, please, Miss Puerto Rico. Miss Puerto Rico, I will ask you the same question I've asked the other two women. If you were to become Miss Universe, what is the single most important thing you would want to accomplish? Oh, you go. Okay. You yes, I know. Okay. Eh, la, tendríamos que usar nuestro pasado para trabajar bien fuerte en, en nuestro presente para tener un mejor futuro y un mejor mundo. Y pienso que lo primero que haría sería hablar con la juventud y con los niños que son el futuro del mundo darles el amor y los consejos que ellos necesitan, porque si queremos un mejor mundo, tenemos que trabajar ahora con ellos, que son su futuro. I, I think that we would have to work basing ourselves on our past, working hard in the present to provide for a better future. I believe that we should turn our energies to the children of the world to provide for them a better future, because that is where our future lies. Thank you, Senor. Please, if you will, stand over here. Very nicely done, ladies. Hold on just a moment now. The judges will make one last decision now. This is the final vote to determine the winner. As each contestant steps forward, the judges will give her a ranking of three, two, or one. And as they vote for her, they will be doing so to elect her as the second runner-up, the first runner-up, or the new Miss Universe. And we will begin. And finally, Miss Puerto Rico. Ladies and gentlemen, that completes our competition for Miss Universe 1993. We'll be... Thank you, ladies, if you'll join me now. And now, we're about to reveal the name of the first runner-up and the new Miss Universe. Let me remind you of the importance of the first runner-up. If Miss Universe is unable to compete or brain for any reason, the first runner-up will become Miss Universe. Ladies, good luck to both of you. The first runner-up is Miss Columbia. Miss Universe is Miss Puerto Rico. Congratulations to Miss Puerto Rico. You are Miss Universe of 1993. You've won the cash awards and the prizes worth more than $200,000. And as our entire cast serenades you, here's the traditional walk as the new Miss Universe. Portions of this program have been pre-recorded. When the system doesn't work, there's only one type of justice, dark justice, later tonight on Crime Time After Prime Time. This is Mark McEwen. Thanks for making CBS America's Most Watched Network. I'll see you Monday on CBS This Morning. Now get ready for your local news. Cecilia, you put the crown on for Cecilia Boloco, for Angela Visser, Dick Clark. Good night, all.